BattleBot Royale 2013 at the Tool Library. Picture this. People have been given a box of contents. And this is everything from the motors, the wheels, the breadboard, the connectors. So from those materials, they've, they're building their robots over one and a half hours. And then, uh, and then we'll have these battles happening right afterwards. We got involved with uh, Tool Library because we really want to support the maker community in all of their projects and future endeavors. In terms of uh, the best robot, it really comes down to strategy. So uh, do you want a slow, heavy robot that can push the, the enemy robot out of the ring, or do you create something that, that's fast and that can pop balloons and get more points? So um, it really should be interesting. Everyone's taking a, a different approach, and uh, honestly don't know who's, who's going to win. Tactics-wise, we have these awesome spinning spikes, which will shred any balloons and hopefully opponents on either side of us. Um, we have these sort of feelers, which are modeled after fish, which kind of grab their prey and pull it in towards their mouth. And this seems to do most of the popping in our tests. Yeah. Um, it yeah. pops a lot, and it pops loudly. And, and yep, yeah, that's everything. That's why they call them popsicle sticks. It's for their balloon popping skills. I put one um, a spike on the back so if I go backwards it's gonna pop the balloon and two spikes on the sides so if the balloon's either way then it's gonna pop it. Do you think you're gonna win? Mm, maybe. <laughs> Winner takes off. Three, two, one.